Here we have a game with El Famir playing. Remember Famir? On the battlefield. Ready to go, eh, hey, Jeff? What'd you bring hey, for us, Jeff? I, I brought for you some um, some demons of Nurgle. Some. 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 Not many, some is some. a euphemism, isn't it, Jeff? Because mm, really, you have got a lot. Uh, this is give or take a hundred guys. Give or take a hundred guys. You want to take us through what you brought here, Jeff? Not a problem. With your hundred guys. Hundred guys. Uh, so I've got uh, three units of thirty plague bearers. They're the sure do. Foot troops of Nurgle. They're mm. nothing very special. Uh, two singular beasts of Nurgle. Oh, hey. they're singles, are they? Yeah, they're singles. Oh. Nothing wrong with singles. No. Uh, and three flies. No. Uh, plague drums, I think they're called. Yep. I can't recall what they do, so I have to refer back to my books. I think they spit stuff. Uh, they they sting sets. stuff. Yeah. And they, they kind of stabby stabby with their stingers. Proboscis, maybe. Probi probiotics. Probiotics. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've also got a scrivener. Who once upon a time ago used to be a battle standard bear, which don't exist anymore, unfortunately. I miss battle standard bears. They miss too. battle standard bears. I miss them. They were great. Them. And a herald of Nurgle. Ah, that's a bunch of stuff. It's a shame they won't be here for long, Jeff. Because, oh, all right. because, because I have got for me. Remember for me. <clears throat> so, we've got a bunch of twenty shells. Um, which is like the Famir slaves, the tiny ones, which today will be played by um, Savage Urox. Um, the part of them will be played by Savage Urox. Bought myself a basilisk. Um, it doesn't do much, but it's very lizard like, and it looks like Famir, sort of. So I bought one along because it matched the theme. It's very chameleonistic. Yeah, this guy, on the other hand, the Dreadmoor, is vicious. He's vicious. He is super vicious. He tunnels, he's great at destroying units of little dudes. Um, if they don't have disgustingly resilient, that is, because disgustingly resilient. Um, over here we have our Dyrak uh, Mist Weaver, which will be played today by a Firebelly. A Firebelly. Firebelly from the Ogres seems to have the best. They breathe fire, and these guys breathe mist. Maybe so I thought that was the closest sort of proxy. Two big units of nine Vermeer Warriors will be doing most of the punch packing today. Um, and they've got in the front there a Famir Noble leading them. Also ready to tear some stuff up. He's using like his Sword of Justice, I want to say, from the Ugu list. Um, so he's ready to take on monsters and champions and wreck them. So I hope some of yours have the monster keyword. Uh, it's going to be pretty weird if they don't. Yeah, they don't. Damn it. Oh well. But I will take you up on your offer of uh, trial by combat. Nice. I will do it. Let's do this. Now, we are playing one of the missions that's coming up in Sydney Slaughter in a couple of weeks because I need the practice. <coughs> Basically because even though I've played Warhammer and Age of Sigma for ages, I've always just played pitch battles and see what happens. So this objective keeping thing is weird for me. So this mission we're going to start off with one objective in each of our own territories, which is worth one point each to us. This one in the middle here at the top is worth two each time we end a turn um, and we are in control of it. And if we control the other players, we get three points a turn. Now, fortunately for the Famir, um, the more models you have um, within six inches, you control the objective. That's gonna work to my advantage. You've got a mighty big unit of uh, slaves over there. I've got a big unit of shells, so that's hopefully gonna keep something for me. But everyone else, is definitely being outnumbered by parents, <laughs> for sure. So, um, I have managed to deploy first, which isn't hard with the Famir army, but I'm going to give Jeff turn one. How gracious. I know, I'm gracious as stuff. As that guy. That's how graceful I am. Um, <laughs> we'll get back after the movement phase. All right, Jeff. Yes. We've made a mistake. We made it. Since we probably should have been filming from the hero phase. But you did in the hero phase what exactly? I'm trying to remember. Nothing. Nothing. Except you collected oh, how collected many corruption points? That is correct. I, co I, I, I collected seven corruption points. Seven corruption points. Seven like corruption it points. was nothing. And then Damn, he did so his much. movement. So you can see all these guys have marched 
Only very slightly, slightly forward. closer. Slightly closer. But that's forward. okay, isn't it, Jeff? Because at the end of your movement phase... At the end of my movement phase, what I'm going to be doing is using the command ability out of the novels. We are using this particular mission coming up, Sydney Slaughter. Yes, yes. Which gives you the command ability of tunneling, just like you were a Skaven. Yes, yes. And popping up elsewhere. Skaven plague bearers, best thing since sliced bread. Skaven bearers. Skaven bearers. Skaven. Right. And what are we going to do with it to oh. make me cry, Jeff? Oh, what I'm going to do is, command, is expand my command point to yep. remove this unit that is within 12 inches of my general. Well and truly within 12 inches. Sure is. To tunnel anywhere on the battlefield I would like. Okay. So long as I'm 9 inches away from your glorious Hamirs. Yes. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this massive blob of metal, metal as F. Definitely metal, because these are old school models. And they will come towards right here at that objective marker. Of course. And they will all gather around this and claim it for Papa Nurgle. Papa Nurgle, Grandfather Poxman. Grandfather Poxman. Okay, so now that you've done that, that brings us to... Being in my movement phase, where I'm going to expend my seven contagion points. Oh god, here it comes. Another gross tree. Another gross tree, here it comes. Here it comes. We, we, are, we are planting the seeds of Nurgle everywhere where we go. Uh, now these, these speculant normals, they don't do very much. Except win you the game? They Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> they, they give me extra contagion points. They also allow me to slingshot my units forward when they advance, because they can advance and charge. So happy for you. Hey, 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 so happy hey, hey, hey. for you. Awesome. That's the end of the That's movement phase? End of my movement phase. Oh, fantastic. Alright, so now what do we do? Uh, well, I've got no shooting as I'm playing Nurgle, and I've got no combat at the moment, so I'm going to pass my turn. <gasps> pass the turn to me? Pass the turn. Let's do it. Let's do this. <laughs> and we are back with Andy's uh, hero phase. Hero phase. Because we remembered to do the hero phase this time. Speaking of heroes? Speaking of heroes. Look at him. Isn't he gorgeous? <laughs> um, <laughs> So we're going to start with casting. I'm going to see if I can get up an Aether Void Pendulum, which is going to swing towards his mighty units over there. I need to cast on a six uh, from the Mist Weaver or Fire Belly, whichever you prefer. We've got our six. You definitely got you, your six. Uh, dispelling. Are you able to dispel more than 30 inches away? I'm guessing I'm at 48 so to 50. I guess, I guess <laughs> you're leaving too. So I'm going to send this straight towards your objective on that side. So if anyone stays near it, we mm. can uh, flatten them. So this it's is going to go air. fairly straight all the way up to that piece of scenery. And then, hopefully, on through in the coming terms. As long as it doesn't get got rid of. All right, we'll be back at the end of the movement phase. And we've done our movement now. And it's spectacular because, just like I planned, that unit from over there by the general, within 12 inches of him, came to here to attack plague bearers. But shooting, I'm out of range. Mm. And because we were very clever with our camera skills, um, yeah. we, we may have already rolled for charges uh, without recording it. And these guys definitely got a 7 instead of a 9, seven which they nine. needed. Which means everyone's out of range for shooting and everyone's out of range for charging. Um, but the good news is... We did roll for turns. We did roll for second turn. So after we've counted up and Jeff has got 3, three. Uh, for his objectives, carrying this objective and the one in his own territory. And I'm on 1, which may be a sad start for the Famir, but we have done our roll off. And I have gotten a six, so it'll be double turning for the Famir. Retiring in the 1980s, <laughs> Famir are back, okay. and they're on a double turns, baby. Let's go. It's Jeff, and Jeff's Jeff. excited because going second in turn two means that he is in charge of the pendulum. The pendulum. Is it going to move eight inches, Jeff, towards your line, or is it going to move one inch? Well, or point one of an inch. It's all up to you. It's zero to... Well, I don't think you can do zero. But it's well, up to eight inches. And in good fashion. In a straight and line. So we're gonna we're gonna go straight through this. Oh. And we're gonna end up eight inches. Put Remember. a little reminder to subtract. Subtract two. Subtract two next turn. Well done. I would never have thought of that, Jeff. That is why you are in charge. That is why I'm in charge of the pendulum and this. Alright. So I'm gonna do my hero phase, which yes. is going to involve 
Um, so I'm just going to do something simple like Mystic Shield, mm -hmm. uh, which I've lived at five on the Vermeer that are here. So we are going to get that well and truly on a 10. Oh, okay. So they are going to reroll ones for their save. All right. Shooting! Uh, wait, 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 phase, wait. the Basilisk does stuff. Ooh, the the basilisk. Phase. So the Basilisk is going to uh, Malignant Gaze. It's going to Medusa up some stuff. Ooh. So in your hero phase, pick one enemy unit that's within 12 inches of this model. Oh my god, this might not actually work <laughs> yeah, because I'm bad at measuring. And no, it is. Just we got 12. 12 inches, just on 12. <laughs> um, pick a unit that's within 12 inches of this model, roll a dice on a 1, nothing happens. 2 to 3, it suffers D3 mortal wounds. 4 plus D3 plus 1 mortal wound. So we're rolling. We got our 3, which means D3 mortal wounds on your plague bearers. Uh -oh. uh -oh. Ready? 2. 2. 2 mortal wounds. Alrighty. Got our basilisk. Uh, I've got a 5 plus disgusting resilience. Eh? 5 plus, no less. 5 plus. Not a 6. So, that's a 4 and a 4. So that, that is, is 2. That is 2, two down bearers. Oh, oh that's a shame. Two. I'm gonna miss those guys. As you can see, this guy's for the next. Coughed it. He's all covered in blood. Five He's minutes done. until they're back. You reckon? Maybe ten minutes. Uh, maybe ten minutes. Maybe ten minutes maybe, until maybe, they come back. Until they come back. As demons do. Um, that is the hero phase. Next is movement. So we'll be back after movement. Okay, shooting phase. Shoot the phase. movement is done. We have moved up, ready to wipe out. <laughs> <laughs> this unit of plague bearers never happened. Um, we've used our tunneling again, and we've abandoned our objective, Jeff. Abandoned it to come and crush some skulls. Genius move. <clears throat> genius move. Tactical genius. We've run with our shells, so they're out for this turn, but let's see what we can do with shooting. Now, our basilisk is going to spit oh. at your uh, plague bearers. Ten inches. Ten inches. Easy Shoot done. Right this time. Um, now, watch this. Watch Acidic Spit. It's one attack. Oh, one attack. Fives to hit. Oh, minus one. No, there's your one. Wow. There's your six. Minus there's... one, yeah. You, you did it. You did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, to wound is twos. Oh. Oi, look out. That'll and do it. The, the damage is one. And what's the uh, rend? The rend is minus one. Minus one. So my five plus turns to a six plus. Yes. That's not a six plus. That's not a six plus. No. Oh, I am disgustingly resilient on you, a five plus. I am. You are. That's not a five plus. So. I can't even multiply those two a five. No. No. I, I got one. You got one. What's not that? Doesn't that look like a worthy shot from this gigantic beast? One damage. One shot. One shot. One shot. One kill. Nonsense. So actually, it's three. Three dead plague bearers from three Basilisk. Three dead plague bearers? In one turn. We're getting there. Mist Weaver or Fire Belly is six inch range, so we're gonna go straight to the charges, Jeff. Straight to the charges. And we're gonna start with the Femir over here, which looks like a five will do it, Jeff. A five will get you around. Yeah, let's hope it's bigger though, so we can get a good wrap around. Only just, Only just but I'll six. take it. I'm not gonna press the issue. I wanna to get to that objective. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. I think the Dreadmore might be able to make it somehow. No, you're gonna roll three. You're gonna roll a double one. Snake two. eyes, you reckon? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's why I'm sure Now that's ten, turn. and I can technically tunnel under stuff. So I'm gonna skip mm. right to the back here to surround them and do as much damage as possible. These guys who just tunneled will obviously need nine plus to reach the bugs. Let's do it. Let's get a 10! Get a 10! Ouch! I'm liking this. Although, I probably should move him slightly and see if I can get my the hero. general in on a 10 also. What are the chances of two 10s in a row? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm selling a 3 and a 3. You're selling a 3 and a 3? Selling a 3 and a 3. It. Place your bets. It's a, it's a 9. Oh, not enough. It's just a shy. Just short. Oh well. It will have to be the Vermeer Warriors representing on their own in that combat. Um, now we're in combat phase, Jeff. I think I'll start with the Plague Bearers. What do you the think? Bears. You may as well start the Horde versus the, uh, the Horde. We'll pile in. Um, yeah, there's, t it's just, there's still 20, isn't there? Because they're, they're 
or a much bigger unit. They, they, uh, they're still 27 remaining. So okay. You, you got your work cut out for you. I got a two inch range on these um, swings though, so that should be helpful. All right, let's see what Familiar Warriors can do, Internet Land. It's been a while since we saw them in action. A whole army of them, no less. So they have three attacks a piece. That'll do it. Well, luckily, Andy, we have this contraption here. A dice box. Oh, I don't know if I trust a dice box that you're going to give me, Jeff. What's wrong with it? Oh, nothing. It's going to be all ones. All ones? All ones. Let's hope it's all threes, in fact. Because that's what we want. And look, it was all ones, just like you said. Oh, well, there we go. Uh, oh, okay. Um, twos are out. Ones are out. That was no good. And... But they're Bellglyph Malls. Oh, so... There we go. An unmodified wound roll of a six. Now you had something if I rolled a six to hit or to wound. Yeah, so the, uh, the, the cycle of disease, I believe it's called. Uh, the one that I rolled for this turn here until my next turn is re-rolling your wounds of a six. Right, so if I roll a six, I get a mortal wound. But if I roll a six, I have to re-roll re it. That. I have to roll a six twice if I want to get a free mortal wound. That's, on that's correct, Andy. Thanks, Jeff. You're a champ. I try to be blanked. Here we so, go. So, it is three to wounds. Oh, of course, look at all those sixes. Uh -oh. Okay, so they would be mortal wounds, but they're not now, thanks to Jeff. I try. So, there's that many wounds going through, and these ones are getting re rolled. Thanks to Jeff. You're welcome. Hey! Oh, look at all the sixes again! So, so sixes. that is, let's put. One, two, three mortal wounds on top of the regular wounds. So, just mortal wound saves, Jeff. Just mortal wounds. Just mortal okay. wound saves. So I've got a five up against your mortal wounds. Go for it. None no, of those. None of those. I don't like your dice, Andy. Good start. Good start. Normal wounds, Jeff. Mm. Now they are red minus two. Okay, so that takes my five plus armor save to a seven plus armor save, which sure I don't does. think I can make. So it's back to the fives anyway. We're back to the fives anyhow. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh, there's three saves. It's three saves. So Which it's means... Three, six, eight dead plague Eight bears. dead plague bears. Get that back on a D3, dead. Jeff. Get that back on a D3. I can get up to three of those back. <laughs> three of those back. Now that's their malls. They've got tails left to strike with. So oh. be happy to know. The Femir have club tails. Now the club tails are only one inch range. So it's only the ones at the front. All one, right. two, six, seven. And they are fours and threes, Jeff. Fours, fours and threes. Threes. I am getting excited now. There we go. Looking for them three. No pluses. more sixes, please. Three more sixes. No more sixes. Ah, uh, another six. But they're all three, they're all so threes. I have to re-roll this one. No, no. you ruined it, Jeff. You my, ruined my, it. So my master plan has come to fruition. You've saved one wound. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> um, this is no rend. So no rend. Oh, so five. five plus. Yep. Oh, Ooh, so two. Good. Saves gone. And then my disgusting resilient. There you go. No. I got one. I got one with a tail. Yeah, with the Huzzah. Tail. That's my choice for a combat, Jeff. What's your choice to be? Well, my choice is going to be over here. Ah. I've got these. Alrighty. So, I've got three flies. Mm -hmm. So, I can't shoot you in combat with my death heads, but I've got foul mouth parts. Ooh. Foul mouth. Foul mouth parts. Sounds like you, Jeff. Very. It does sound like one. Uh, so they've got two attacks apiece, they're foul on both parts, hitting mm -hmm. on threes and wounding on threes. Okay, make it happen. So we've got wow. two, one, one miss. That's some serious hits. And now these wound on threes. Mm -hmm. uh, and what's the rend on those bad boys? The rend on that is nil. Nil? Nil! Okay. They like to serve, but they're not very good at it. Okay, so the Femirs have got their four up save. And they didn't make either of those. Cool. What's the damage on Foul Mouthery? Foul Mouthery is one damage, a whole single damage per. Oh, single damage, which single means damage. I've got to borrow this dice and say that this Vermeer here is on mm. the left. And then they have their Plague Swords. Uh oh. Uh, so they've got one attack apiece with the Plague Swords, though the champion has two. So uh -huh. four Good. swings, heading on fours. So got so one four. miss, yeah, and wounding on threes. 
That is two so more. Ten. Is only missing one per round? What's the rend on a plague sword? Nothing. 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 Four ups again. Well, this time I got one, but that is one too many. That's one too many. One for me. Is brought off the first Vermeer death since 1989. <laughs> I'll take it. Of okay, what else you got? From there we have our prehensile probiotics. Probiotics. Pro -pro -pro probiotics. Yes. Yeah. Going on here. So with that we've got three attacks apiece. Mm -hmm. Hitting on threes. Okay. Now well, we've got a few misses. Right. Could do with a couple more misses. Okay. I'll take that. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> Now these are uh, not the greatest are hurting you, they're winning already, 4 plus. 4 plus. Let's see them. You got a whopping 2. 2 wounds, okay. Not enough, a damage 1? Damage 1. Okay, 4 ups. Let's, no, we missed both again. Missed both. So we've got another Vermeer down to 1 wound. Mm. And then we're using our Venomous Stings. Oh my god, there's more? There's How more. How many attacks do these things have? Uh, Jeez. six. Six. <laughs> six of Okay, uh, so the Venomous Sting hits on a four plus. Uh -huh. That's hit once. Mm -hmm. They wound on a three plus. That's a three. Alright. That's a negative one rend. Negative oh, one rend, now we've runs. got a negative rend. So now we need fives. Watch, watch me fail that one. Okay, this one is damage D3. Uh oh. That's uh -oh. for one damage. Oh, well, that's enough. That's two for me. Out of combat, and the units are not that big, so that's gonna hurt me when I get to fight back. Is that it? That is it for those lads. Oh, is that all? All right, so I get to pick a combat now. Yeah, you get to pick combat, Andy. I'm gonna see if I can get this Dreadmore in. If he's in three inches, I think he might be. Judging from that uh, square base yes. tray that you've got there. From the square base tray with 25 mils per square. Yeah, uh, there two we go. Inches. You should be sweet. Three inches. Let's get in there. Now, this is the guy that can kill stuff. Mm. Dreadmore can kill stuff. So, let me check my printed out piece of paper, Jeff. Nice and easy. Um, he is going to start by me realizing that he had a shooting attack this whole time. Yeah. So. That's unfortunate. <laughs> uh, live and learn, live and learn. Now, so, re remember this for next week. Re yeah, range three, cavernous more with our three attacks on threes and on twos. Let's have it. Threes up and twos. Two wounds. Let's do it. That's two wounds, Jeff. That's two wounds. Now, the cavernous more is rend minus three, sir. Straight to my disgustingly resilient. Mm. Am I resilient this time, Andy? Once. One time. Once. Once. I'm resilient. So the damage for a cavern is more is D6. Ooh. We should have rolled that separately. Should we have rolled that separately? We should have rolled that separately. Oh, because you do it after the damage. I do after the, the damage. The That's thing. correct. Oh. Well, let's say you rolled two. Plus. You need four more. Four more. Four more. So you saved one. Saved one. You lost one. And here's your other four for okay, your so one disgusting. Dies. One's dead so far. So... We know what we're doing, internet shut The damage doesn't carry over. Yes, it does. It does? Yeah, in okay. 40k it doesn't carry over. Okay, that's yeah, only yeah. in my confusions. Yeah, oh, right. Survey says... Three more. So three four, more. Four down, two saves. Four, four, four dead smelly boys. Mm. That is just attack one, Jeff. That was attack one. How many attacks does this guy have? Two. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but his next attack has D3 attacks. Ooh, D3 first. So, 3D3? Uh, yeah, 3D3, so, sorry, yeah, not D3. D3. <laughs> 3D6. Uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 attacks. 4. 3D6 six attacks, not 3D3 attacks. 8, 9, yes, 3D6. I misspoke. Better not do that at Sydney Store. <laughs> I could upset a lot of people. Okay, fours and fours this time around. It's um, a lot of not fours. It's a lot of not fours, unfortunately. Mm. And that's a none fours. So no that fours. is none of the fours. Well, he had a good solid swing at the beginning. Okay, so we're looking for high numbers with the uh, battle shock. I'm feeling for this particular combat. Um, but first, you get to strike back. I do get to strike back. So next, my swings will be versus. Okay, I think 
That will be all that I can get onto the worm. Mm -hmm. So that will give me one, two, three, six attacks on the worm. Okay. So I'm hitting you on fours. You are, okay. And I am wounding you on... Now, did I make you re-roll any wounds? Did you get any wounds of a six? I did not get any okay. sixes that time. I was watching. Right, I forgot to watch that one. Uh, threes. Okay. One wound on your worm. No rend? No rend. Okay, three ups. Past. And he's loving large and loving life. He is living. And then we've got five fellas versus the Femir Warriors. Okay. The one is a champ, so he gets additional swing. Okay. There you so, go. Hang on for it. Two go away and winning you on threes. Okay. Oh, that's, that's three wounds on your like it. Four up saves for the Femir. Oh, none of them. You've taken out a whole Femir again. Taking down. Ouch. Straight off. Straight off down for the count. Ouch. Okay. Well, that's that combat. Any special surprises for me or is that going to be it? That'll be it. Okay, so I will strike back against the flies. I slide into your DMs. It's yes. You disgusting moth things. Sliding into your disgusting moths. Yeah, I'm sure I can breeze through another 60 plague bearers to get to your objective. You'll be right. Yeah, you'll be right. That'll be fine. Right. All right, threes and threes. Let's do this. Three. No sixes. Oh, wow. I could do with some threes, though, there. Well, you got a few bad. Not bad. Not, not bad. Not bad. Okay. I'm looking for uh, not sixes. Not sixes. Let's go three, four, and five. Not ones and twos. Not ones and twos. Not ones and twos. Okay, mm. so these ones have to be re-rolled. Mm. Thanks, Jeff. You're welcome. Okay, so we got one mortal wound in there and the other two hit, so we'll just keep that one in with the others. Oh, actually, no, you don't get a... Oh, no, you don't get a save on any of these, so you may as well just roll. Oh, my, disgusting. things. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten wounds. And ten die. <laughs> That's not a lot of fives. That is not a lot of fives. It's only three fives. Mm -hmm, three fives. And That's six. seven wounds. Uh, they have a whopping five wounds apiece. Ouch! That is. I was hoping you'd say four or something. Yeah. Right, so we're gonna clean off five. We're gonna take away the champion. Okay. It's five, and we're gonna put two wounds on that fella, who is the man who throws the bell. Okay. Um, I believe that's combat over. It's combat over. So I am going to need a bat shock over here. That's having, why over there. Having lost two of my guys and peering over the table to see a bravery of seven for the Femir Warriors. So let's get a low one. Five, six, seven. That's enough. They are just safe. They are just safe. Um, the other Femir lost one, but... Can't fail on it. Can't, can't get a seven from there. That's going to be an awful roll for you. Eh? <laughs> so we're, we're starting with five. <laughs> five and one is six more now. <gasps> that one is magic. What, 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 yeah, what, don't they get d6 more if they're oh. Did you bring the icon? Tell me you didn't bring the icon. I have the icon. Damn it! No! I have the icons. There no, we go. that's not what I want. There we go. I don't I'm, need I'm d6 with the more icon. of them. Uh, so the icon allows me to bring in. Unmodified rule of a one and making a battle shock includes the icon bear no models from the unit flee instead D6 return. Oh my So we are God, returning That is exactly what I did not want. Four. Four is okay. Oh you're kidding. <laughs> Which means that's before the end of phase, so I won't be able to outnumber you now. After all of that fighting and fuss. After all the fighting and fuss. I do not get control of that objective. Damn you, Father Nurgle! <laughs> we love his brilliantness. Not cool. Not cool, not cool. Right. Let's suppose these guys have like a bravery of three, that would be so well, They've got a bravery of ten as well. No! Oh well, no point rolling for them. Not that one. That was... Well, they do have an icon bear, so if I roll the one... Oh, that's right, you want to take a battle shock test, don't you? Don't you... T oh! <laughs> get lost. That's like an auto one drone that's though, isn't it? Uh, they don't get d6, they get like an auto one. <laughs> Burned. Good thing you uh, kept the standard, dude. Yes, indeed. Standards Ouch. are always the last ones to go for these reasons. Alright, um, so that was my turn two done. That's your turn and two. And you're going to get the next round. Okay. 
Jeff remembers back. half of what he just read from his phone. Yes. So we're going to start his turn now. <laughs> By the way, we didn't forget to count. I just did not get any <laughs> of those <laughs> objectives that turn because I left one behind to get to this one all through these plague bearers, which was a smart <laughs> idea. And he regened, so yeah, I don't yeah. outnumber him anymore. No, sir. So, no, sir. None for me. And you're going to do something fecundous. Fecundous. So Probably. what I'm going to do first is I'm going to generate my contagion points. Okay. Uh, so I automatically generate three contagion points. And then I generate an additional 2d3 contagion points for having two mineral walls on the table with any enemy units within three inches of it. Well, that's unfortunate. So I'm going to generate an additional three. Three. To get to six contagion points. Okay. So I'm not going to be summoning anything this turn. Though my, my tree has turned a dial. Now, okay. I'll be picking three d3 units. Two. Two units. They're within 12 inches of each other. So I'm going to be picking your dread mall there. Of course you are. And the Thumir Warriors. Mm -hmm. Each unit suffers d3 mortal wounds. Wow. So the, the dread mall will suffer a whopping two mortal wounds. Now the Dread Maw still has a save against Mortal Wounds, I believe. On a 4-up. On a 4-up. Mortal Wounds are negated, sir. May the odds be ever with you. That's they are. two they saves are. from Mortal Wounds. I need to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> <laughs> and against your Fremir Warriors there, they will be copying three Mortal Wounds. Well, you say three, Jeff. You say three. I'm saying three. But. Did I say three? They have Shrouding Mist, which Ooh. gives them... A save against mortal wounds, Jeff. There we go, there we go. So, this one's a 5 up, though. No, it's not a 4 up. It's a it's disgusting and resilient sort of save. Let's do it. Uh, and we get none of those. So, mm -hmm. you were right. It was, was 3. Right. And here goes another one. Another one back to dust. Dead. Okay. And then... Because That's what I'm... I get for opening my big mouth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, following on with that, because I've got the tally band of Nurgle going on here, mm -hmm. um, my flies here will regenerate one wound. Okay. No, I can find that dice. So. Sounds like cheating. Smells like cheating. <laughs> but it's not cheating. Probably <laughs> fine. Uh, and I believe that was all the wounds that were carried here. Now over there, because they are plague bearers, they regenerate D3 guys. So but they already are... regen six, and of course you would roll. And then of course I get the three, so I get three try. more guys back. Of course you did. That just happened. <sighs> three more guys coming back. Is that going to be enough, Jeff, though? Is three going to be enough? Probably not. Probably not. But we'll we'll seriously try. hoping not. <laughs> <laughs> but we will try. We're back. We're back. Movement's done. Movement down and so. We've got a lot less plague bearers at this side of the board, Jeff. What happened to them? Well, I use my magical command point to tunnel underground or, as I like to call it, explode in a rain of gore and, and not so pleasant things. Yeah. And magically reappear yeah. over here to. Pus tunnel. Pus tunnel there, exactly. Into Revealing a perfectly and immediately Andy's giant mistake. Mm. Just leaving that behind and, and getting secure. into combat. Um, that's that's pretty much. We've got all these all guys who have swarmed up and making these for me feel a little bit less secure yes, yes. about their choices in life. Um, but this is what is going to end the game <laughs> in very short order. Um, I don't see myself getting back there too soon. Mm. All right. Um, shooting, Jeff? What's that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On to the charge phase. Charge the phase. That's what we recognize as demon players. What's going to be? What's going to be is first order of business is we're going to charge this, uh, this beast of Nurgle here into these familiar warriors. Oh, but Jeff, that beast of Nurgle advanced, surely. Oh, uh, so Beast and Nurgle can advance and charge in their own rule set. Oh, in their own rule set. In their own rule set. Wow, well, so yes. Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah, Aren't we excited about very that? They're very okay. unfortunate. They're very unfortunate. He's going to have to roll three, though. He's going to have to roll, have have to roll, roll three. three and it's... He certainly does. He certainly... Well, and truly, in he goes. Mm. Uh, next order of business is the other pupper over here. Oh, right. He's going to try his luck at charging as well. That's going to be a ways, it's but... It's going to be a ways. We're going to, how far can you... If anyone can do it, Jeff, that it'll be you. It'll be, if anyone, it's going to be a beast of Nurgle if anybody can do this. <laughs> so he will need a magical nine inches. To get okay. Now, statistically, this shouldn't happen. No, statistically not. 
And, and it, did it did not. And it did not. So We're happy with that. Statistics are accurate. Stay in school. Stay in school. Do maths class. Do Don't maths. whinge about it. Exactly. Do, you do know what? Maths. The special announcement, kids. If there's any kids watching this, your maths teacher hates maths as well. None of us want to be there. Stop making it a chore. Just sit through your maths class and do your damn work. And no matter what your teacher told you, you will always have a calculator with you. Always. Always. Especially if you've got a mobile phone. Right. One of these little lads here, they come with a phone, they come with a phone built into your calculator. The amount of time I see kids like get out their phone and Google the answer to a maths question, it's like you've got a calculator on the side of your phone. <laughs> Just punch it in the damn get calculator. calculator out. It, 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 it turns sideways and it's scientific even. <laughs> right. It's magic. Right. Speaking of magic. Speaking of magic. What's happening next? Uh, next is the plague barrier to this lovely little bunch here. Oh. Well, I hope you roll a dull one. Oh, I think if I don't have a double one, I'll get you. Well, you've got to stay three inches away, champ. Oh, that's true. That's, 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 that's the whole point of the double one. That's the whole point of the double one. Well, yeah, here watch we go. Yourself. Statistically, I should make this. Oh my that's god! That's the double one! Oh my god! It's the double one! It's happened! It's happened. There we go. So no plague bearers for you, sir. Oh, well, hey. <laughs> They try, they try. Oh, I'm gonna have to do that every game. Like, like, <laughs> and then they kind of poop themselves. I think they started like hugging the furry tree. They like the furry tree. They're a little bit. Mm. They, 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 they love its, its boils. They mm. love squeezing the boils, such as one would, one would squeeze a, uh, a grapefruit to check for its ripeness. Right, okay. That was yes. a bit too much information, Jeff. But yes. <laughs> <laughs> was that all the charges? That's, uh, well. They're not too far to charge anything. Except that damn objective. Oh. You suck. Yeah, I, I try, I try. I, try. <laughs> <laughs> I believe that's all for my charges. So next comes okay. the, the combat phase of things. Okay, so you're our first choice. What's it going to be? So first, first choice will be, uh, I'm going to fight over on this side of the table here. Okay, we're bringing it back to Can these plague bearers. Yeah, so this big bears here versus those Femir warriors. These unbanishable plague bearers, which so, I really need to finish off. Shuffle across to there. And I believe they'll put the majority against the Premier Warriors. So, okay. first order of business is we're going to try to punch that Dreadmont in the face. Okay. So that's where its spiky bits are. That's where its spiky bits right are. Right in the face. Right in the face. So, my five plague bears have five little jab jabs. Yep. Hitting on fours. They jab you twice. Twice. That's two jabs. Uh, and one wound on the Dreadmaw. One wound on the Dreadmaw, and I believe it's a four. To save a Dreadmoor? No, it's a three, I it's apologize. A three to save a and he's gonna get it too. He's living he's, large and loving life. He really doesn't want to get a wound this game. Uh, after a few plague bears. I was gonna say, you know who does love taking wounds? <laughs> the Warriors, for some reason. And the plague bears too, clearly. <laughs> so, against that group of Famir Warriors, there I've got a whopping one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. He's just the champion, so that makes it the Baker's Dozen. <laughs> Bring it a 13, here we go. Here we go. Alright, so those dice there mean nothing. These ones here mean all the marbles. Yep. Hitting you on fours. Mm, some more fours than last time. So a few more fours than last time. And now we're looking for threes. There's a few more threes than last time. There's one that won't cut it, so it's five. five. Five little stabby stabs. Five stabby stabs. Now we're going for the four plus save, I believe. Mm. Premier Warriors on the four. Nobody wants to die. Oh, and we'll nice save today. someone from dying because that will be one wound left over on this guy. Okay. And then I will get to choose combat. You will get to choose combat. I'm definitely going for those Premier on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> that is what's happening right now. Okay, so... We're gonna pile in, being careful not to invite any plate bearers to our party. You should invite all the plate bearers to the party. None of the plate bearers. Because you guys make good milkshakes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bring all the pus to the yard. <laughs> Sevens. Seven. Threes and threes. I don't have to reroll sixes anymore, right? Because that's, that's a different tree thing. Let's do it. Um Getting rid of those ones. We don't want those ones. These are against the flies. Those. These are against the... Oh, yeah. There's a dog. We're going to put it all against the flies because I forgot to mention the dog. So, mm. all against the flies. Let's all do it. Flies. All the sixes now. Come on. All the twos and threes and ones. Yes. Lots of, lots of sixes. Here we go. So, 
That is five mortal wounds. And then I will add one, two, three, four, five to these regular wounds that you need to save against. But it's okay. minus two. Do you get a save? I do not. Okay, so we'll not. just chuck them all in the pile and you can roll all really badly. All really badly, all right. Awesome. So we're gonna. We just go ahead and take all of those wounds. Grab all those wounds and we're just going to. So, uh, five so, ups, yeah? So, five ups, so we've got a lot there and there. One, two, two, three, four, saved, and the rest is one, eight, twelve, thirteen. We've got five wounds apiece. And one has. One has a wound on it. So, that's one, that's two. Do they have five wounds? They do have five yeah. wounds. Yeah. Okay, so, he did seven, one died. And he came back. Yes, he did. Bastard. Okay, so it's going to be two dead, so we're going to kill off the squad champion, because he doesn't do very much for us right now. No. And we're going to kill off the... Oh, it has to be the, the one with the wings. The one on the wings first, yeah. yeah. So he's going so... to die, the bell, the bell boy. Mm -hmm. And then... So that's... Carries one. Plus three. Plus three is four, so, so he's got one wound left. He's one room remaining, so he... I'll find the four eventually. Maybe. In the one place it is. There we go. He's taken four wins. He's taken four, he's down to one. Wow. He's just gonna revive everyone, isn't he? Schmuck. Yeah. <laughs> it's your turn for attack. My turn for attack, alrighty. Well, we're going to open up with. Well, not open up because we opened up over there. We're gonna go with the Beast of Nurgle. Okay. Jeez. Let's see what the dog does. The dog does the Can't dog wait. Dog has d6 attacks. d6 attacks, let's see a big fat one. It's six. Oh no, it's the six. It's I couldn't six. do it twice. I couldn't do the double ones yeah, on the charge. Yeah, there we go. Right? Couldn't convince him to get a one for that no, one. unfortunately. Two, three. And I'm taking all the dice that are easy for the camera to read. That would be nice. Okay. I'm sure someone, <laughs> sure our one viewer would appreciate that. That's exactly it. Yeah. Yeah. You're welcome, whoever you are. <laughs> whoever, whoever you too. Whoever is watching a game of For Me <laughs> on YouTube, you're welcome. That's exactly it. Uh, so this this dog hits on a four. Oh. That's half. That's that's statistically accurate. Statistically accurate. That's very true. And he wins on a three. Oh, okay. Mm. So he's wounded you twice. Twice, two wins. And I believe these are no runs. Okay. And just one damage a piece. Okay, so they're back to our fours. And we got both this time, so that is both. no. There we go. And, and nice. then we have his. He's gonna give you a kiss. A kiss? He's gonna give you a kiss, the slobbery tongue. So. I have a dog like that. Yeah? Yeah. Right. Big kisses. Big kisses. Uh, his kisses only one kiss attack. <laughs> As they do. One, one kiss attack. One kiss attack, and a kiss attack hits. Uh huh. And a kiss attack. Wounds. Okay. Now this one is no rend. No rend. So let's get another four and just end this conversation there. There we go. Well, yeah, it's a four. And it's a four. Conversation ended. Conversation ended. Was it going to be a good one? Was it going to be like a D6? A D3. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm glad. It's, it's so much, so much I'm glad we ended that conversation. Yes. Um, I might start with the dread more on this side because you've already attacked. So we don't have to worry okay. about retributions. No retribution over there. I've got to remember there's more than 10 models. Oh no, there's the... Hold on. Uh oh. I can reroll wound rolls of one whilst attacking a target that has one or two wounds. So, three attacks with my cabin is more. Rerolling ones this time. Let's eat um, no, no. some plague bears. Oh, we got a one that time, so we do get to reroll. Here we go. Threes, and it worked. Let's Six. See it. Um, and we got twos to wound. Mm. That's twos, and our rend is. Uh, minus three, so minus no regular saves, so it's 2d6 for your disgusting and really resilient. That's correct. Because it's d6 per. So let's get some, let's get two sixes here, would be good. Ooh, nine. Oh, nine, alright. Nine wounds, nine disgustingly resilient. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. So some, some None would be good. For fives. Okay. Oh, well, that too, too bad. Saved four. So, so five we've got five, five down. down. One, two, three, four, and five. Right, decent uh, start. I think you're outnumbering me this time. I think I might be outnumbering you this time, but I don't get to score until my next turn, so this mm. is a pain. 3d6 coil attacks, and a conda sneaking around. Oh, yes. Stuff. 
That is 15. 15 more attacks for the Dreadmoor. Or is this one around? Oh. Oh. Any fours would be nice. Jeez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was few. That was pretty tense. Set. Fours. Okay. Yeah, we got three. three, but this time it's only Ren minus one. Oh, so it takes me to a six plus save. Six plus save. One save. One save. Now I'm going to see those fives again. Yeah, let's see some more fives. You see a five. It's only taken one. Okay. Take that another plague bearer. Okay. Back to the garden. And it is back to your turn, sir, so choosing a thing to attack with. Oh, I believe you've got a big bug. Alrighty, so over here I've got my bug. So yeah. my bug has two attacks with its foul mouth parts. Okay. And they are both hitting. Okay. And they both wound on a three plus. That's the You really hitting. wanted that one. Why couldn't I do that over on that side of the table? The rend is. There's no rend from these attacks. Four ups. Okay. One save, one through. One save, one through. Okay, so one of our boys takes a wound. He's got two left. Mm -hmm. And we're off to our plague sword. Which hits? Which hits? No wound. No wound. Whew. Let's put these dead bads away. <laughs> and then we're off to our prehensile probiotics. Probiotics. Probiotics are good for you, by the no way. Uh, not these on, ones. Not these ones, this no. is too bad. Hitting on threes. Mm -hmm. And winning on fours. Big ol' big ol' bupkips. And lastly we've got our venomous stinger. Okay. Which hits? Not the stinger. And which no wound. Okay. Phew. There we go. There we Looks go. Looks like they're gonna survive this round. Will the plague bearers though? Is the question. No, they will not. Because we got the familiar warriors to go. And Let's see if we can settle this objective in a more permanent way than we have been. <laughs> Okay, so pile people, pile. Shazam! <laughs> okay, we get what that means. Nobody <laughs> else that's listening does. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, or as we like to say, that's 21. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Alright, praise and praise. Yeah, okay. Okay. Let's get the sixes this time, because we're allowed to. Thank you, Father Nurgle. <laughs> two mortals. Three, three mortals. And one, two, three, four, five missed. So we'll add to that, because you won't get any save saves. Mm, no save saves. So, that many armor saves, my man. Whoops! Well, have another one. I'll take another one <laughs> Alrighty, and we're looking for a 5 plus. It's a whole lot of only 3. There's a whole lot of 3, which means 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Ooh. Leg bearers down. We're getting close to numbers here. So we're going to be taking off a group of 4 here. Another 2, 6. And another 3. Oh, we'll take one, two, three, and keep the command unit alive. Oh, the old command unit's it's all in a row like they should be. That's it. That's which it. gives me only three tails to strike with. And it's fours and threes for the tails. Can we take... No, we can't. No. And threes. We got it, though. We got it. Um, so. No rend. So we're going for a five plus. And he's got it. Very good. They're sticking around. That's the end of combat. End of combat. Is it not? It is. I don't have any battle shock for some reason this turn. And Jeff, I do. You do, <laughs> but you like battle shocks. I don't. Because if you roll a one, I like the one. You I do like the shocks. one. Uh, so we're gonna try the, the the command group here. Okay, try the command. So group you've first. killed one, two, oh, three, what? four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So I'm already at negative five. Anything but a one is gonna be bad for Anything you. Anything but a one takes that unit away. Can we start at the chant? Don't do it, Jeff! Don't do it, Jeff! Yeah! Ah, and there they go! <laughs> Alright. So there goes the command. Right. Try to get no, that one. don't bother rolling it. And try Just to, it. Just and try to get it. me a bug back. No! You can't. <laughs> you can't <laughs> possibly have to. Wait, we're gonna get that bug back. It's not possible. 
So we're going to take back the, uh, the score champion there. Oh my god. This is... This is bad news. Bears. Oh, bad news. Bears all over again. Okay, so we may as well count up your objectives, hey? Alrighty, so... I've got my good old one there that I'm camping turn on. Turn that up to a four, because you got your one. Very good. Yay, we can camp today. <laughs> we can. And that's Andy's one. That's So that's so negative that's three. three. Negative three, negative I'll take three it. three off yours. No, oh. it's not. It's positive three. That's why you suck. Yes, yes. So, it's one to seven. One to seven. Looking good. Now we... Uh, Seven is my magic number. It is. It is. Which is not voting well for me at all. I mm. suppose we should roll for the next turn. We should. Let's see if we can get a double again. Um, let's see if we can... Uh, this time I break ties. This time you break ties. Oh, oh, and I get it again. I think I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll be right back. And we are back. Good like this, huh? <laughs> Very lifelike. It's right, actually, right, uh, right, right, right. if you if you check it out, it's actually life size. It is. Oh. <laughs> it's close. It's, it's close. Pretty, it's close pretty close. close. Um, all right. Now I'm going to do something tricksy here. Oh, I don't like tricksy. I am going to consider get rid of this uh, either void pendulum methinks, uh -oh. and instead recast it. Recast. Um, now, to get rid of it, don't you need to dispel it? No. Then again, then again, maybe I can't do that. Maybe that needs to be unbound. So I'm gonna leave that there. It's pretty close to Jeff's guys. He does it's get to close. move it. Actually, he gets to move it now before I do anything. So I doubt it's going to go the full eight inches slamming into his troops. It might just go one. <laughs> oh, you don't want it within an inch. Because it's within an inch too. <laughs> so we'll back, we'll back that up. A that's little far bit. enough. For that, Jeff is happy with that. For I might cast um, Cascading Fire Cloak or Mist Cloak or on my uh, Dry Arc, which is a six, and they are going to get it with no benefits for rolling an eleven, which is lame. Now I'm going to try to dispel it because this time I'm within thirty of you. Yes, you are, sir. So uh, you need an eleven or higher. Eleven or higher. Well, we will see. We we shall see. We shall. That is not no, it's not that is not it. It's close. So, um, the caster is wreathed in flames or mist. Um, each enemy unit within three inches suffers D3 model wounds on a four. On a four. So, if she gets into combat, she's going to wreak some havoc. Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to go into movement. We shall be back. Done. So, movement's finished. We've got these guys have left the objective, no. which again, I did without having anyone on the objective because I'm super smart, but these guys managed to run and they are now within six. So I get my two points there. These guys have all turned around because I realized what an idiot I was. Three points a turn for Jeff. That can't happen. It's fine. Hopefully, they're all nine inches away now. I used my... Basilisk got closer to my general so that I can use my gnaw holes to move it even closer again. But the leaders are worth 10 men each. That's so correct, if yeah. they can all make their charges and if they can destroy some stuff, then I might be able to outnumber them and get that back. Mm. As long as they don't resurrect all their plague bearers again. We shall see. So shooting phase, uh, let's do some damage. Yes, yes. Uh, <clears throat> we're going to start with our basilisk, which I kept forgetting to shoot with. So he is range... Oh no, I dread more, sorry. Uh, a range 12. So, out of range of the heroes, but... Can do some damage on the plate bearers. <coughs> do some damage to the Excuse players. me. So he is going to do that. One attack. Mm -hmm. Fours and threes. Fours and threes. Gets his four. Come on, three. He gets that two. It's minus two rend. So I'm looking for a 5 plus disgusting resilience. 6 damage though. Oh, that's so great. I'm looking for 6 oh. 5 ups on your plague bearers. Five, 6 5 ups on my plague bearers. I save a whopping 1. 1 save. 1 save. 5 plague bearers have been spat out. Acid spit from the basilisk, which is yes. much less effective, but hits on 5. Does and wounds on a two 
And that is rend minus one. Looking for a six plus save here. No, and it does one whole damage. It's the opposite of six there for the people keeping count. Yeah, let's see. No, that's not it's, a uh, disgusting. Uh, it's not disgusting, so we're going to take away. Not the closest guy. one. Take away the closest one and change that nine to a ten. Not enough. Um, all right, charges then. That's the shooting phase over. Let's start with the unimportant ones. Mm. So all of them, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> the Dreadmoor is going to try and charge these plague bearers. It's going to get five, which is not enough. That's upsetting. The Gafamia are going to charge either the plague bearers or the beast if they can get in. That's a four, which is not mm. enough. But you see, Jeff, that was my plan because those are the unimportant charges. There we go. There we go. This so is now the, uh... the basilisk is going to get his nine. Come on. Which he's not. Mm -hmm. The general, though. The general's going to get his nine. Uh, his, no, he's going to get eight gonna instead. Get eight. The fire belly? Fire belly. Does it still want to charge? <laughs> On its own? It's, it's far as safe, it's safe. It's, no. no, it's not going to make the charge either. Whoa. Um, Good turn. Oh, everything's coming up Millhouse. <laughs> <laughs> uh, which makes the choice of combat phase fairly simple. Huh. Um, I might start with the familiar that are in combat, hey? Uh, that's a, that's, a, that's the, your only choice, yes. And it's the only choice, and we've still got seven there, don't we? Uh, you indeed do. Okay, this time though, <clears throat> I might put one of them against your beast. One against, one against the beast? One against the beast. I, I suppose that's a, it's a well thought out plan. Shut <laughs> Stop lying. Okay, so threes and threes. Let's threes kill and that threes. beast. Here. No? Oh, that's uh, that's uh, the, the alien eyes. Tail against the beast? Tail against the beast? Four? No? Three, four, five, six others on the mosquito thing. I'm gonna see that thing. Slap! Uh, three hits. Decent. I'll take that. And next one is three to win. Three to win. Six is immortals. One, two. Oh, not too many. Mm -hmm. So we add two to that because you won't get saves anyway. And you've got that many, sir. Have this many saves. That many shaves. Alrighty, and these are at negative two. So, looking for a five plus here. We made a few. Three saves, I right, see. So, however, we have one, two, three, four, five. And the other guy just had one wind left, didn't he? He had one wind remaining. <sighs> no more flies no for more you, flies. Buzz Boy. Consider yourself swatted. What's it? Swatooned. That leaves you a beastie. Leaves me the beast. The beast from the east. <laughs> Here he comes. It's D6. D6 it? attacks. Mm -hmm. oh, he's yeah. generating. Four. Oh. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Hitting on a four plus. Two. Two. And it wounds on a three. One. Mm -hmm. So we want a four to save. Come on, guys. No, we only get the two. One damage? One damage. Okay. The damage on one of those for me. Two wounds left. And then he gets to lick you. Yes, that's true. Like a good boy. Mm. He does. He does. He does. He does. Still four ups? Still four ups. No. No. Doesn't make it. D3. D3 wounds. Three. Of course he got a three. One dies and another one has taken a wound as well. There oh. we go. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oopsies. And that can't be the end of my face, surely. Well, that's his, uh, it good, sir. Ouch. So that means I got two. You got two. Which brings me up to three against seven. Are you working your way up? Three. You're working your way up. Uh, this is gonna go very badly. Right, well. <laughs> Jeff's turn. Back we are. And back we are. Uh, so, 
I forgot to record this, but at the beginning of my turn, due to the Taliban of Nurgle, mm -hmm. I get to bring back the three Plague Bearers. Oh yes, so you did, didn't you? I rolled a good old five, bringing back three Plague Bearers to this unit. So happy for you. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then as well, during the command phase, I rolled some dice for my contagion points. So it's taken me to 13 total now. 13. 13, I'm close to 14. Closer to 28 than I was before. That's, yep. That's, that's the one. That's what's happened. Um, I'm also going to bring on my reserves finally. For my reserve <sighs> points. So I'll be bringing on board <sighs> a further 20 of Nurgle's finest. Oh god, they keep coming. They keep coming. Mm -hmm. So these lads will come onto the board here. Is that going to be close enough to you, Jim? I wonder. Uh, they're being nine inches away from an enemy unit, is that right? Maybe. Oh, wow. They do. So, come on, nine inches away from expecting here. a charge? Maybe, maybe. I was expecting a lot of charges last time, but... <laughs> <I didn't. laughs> um, and then, my general will move. Mm -hmm. Is four inches. Which will put these lads within 12 inches. Sure will. Sure will. <laughs> will they, Bob? Uh, and um, I think for the remaining movement, my Beast of Nurgle Hill will retreat from combat. Oh. Now, when he retreats, I roll a dice and on a 4 plus, you take D3 mortal wounds. Sounds like something you would do, Jeff. It is. It All is. right. That's it. So, uh, no. That's not a 4 plus. That's not a 4 plus. So, so he breaks away from combat. Okay. He can also recharge. Really? Yes. Jeff? Really? Yes. 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 Fine. <laughs> Fine. Uh, this dog will join along to there and will also run. A whopping one! Woo! Hello. Uh, the plague bearers here will move four inches and advance. Oh, so they're going a total of eight inches. So they're going to come in. Wrap her around the edges. Make sure they're three away. She'll be far enough away from your big scary lads over there for the time being. Nowhere is far enough away, Jeff. And far enough away. Nowhere is far enough away. Nowhere is far enough. Uh, these lads over here want to come play with your general. Yes, leave the objective. I uh, will indeed. That's a sound idea. Are you leaving the objective so you can just drop another unit on the objective? I, I might be. Oh, <laughs> That's what you get. That's what I get for being clever. Put that there for now. Mm. And that will end my movement phase by spending my command points. Uh-huh. And what are you gonna do with Jeffrey? This unit from this part of the table. Oh, there it is. Over to this Just part of the table. Point. And they are within six inches of the objective to claim it. They sure are. They sure are. Super excited about that. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> After all those turns for my shells to get here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no one else is. Good uh, work, fellas. <laughs> and then comes the charging phase. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, I missed it. What'd you do? I meant to uh, cast a spell. We'll cast a spell then. Uh, it's fine. It's fine? Do it. Do all the right. thing. So we're going to cast a spell to change the tree mode. Okay. So it goes off on a seven. Okay. And she goes off. I will be rolling, I'll be adding one to my win rolls for all the Nurgle units. It's true. Dang. Mm. Not a fan of that. You know what I am a fan of? <laughs> double ones. Double ones. Alright, well, we're gonna try to not roll double ones <laughs> with the dog. Okay. Because the dogs can always advance and charge. Yep. Let's do it. Even though he didn't really move. He just did the way he retreated. He retreated. <laughs> Tail between legs. Spike between tail? Between legs? I don't know. <laughs> where the tail where, where and where the place is. is. Oh, that'll do it. Dang. That's definitely not a double one. No. Uh, and then the other dog will attempt to charge. Okay. That is also not a one. That's also not a one. So that will take this doggy. There. Followed by the horde of plague bearers. Now yeah, it's time for a double one. Now it's time for a double one. No, I didn't get it. Didn't get it. Dang it. This does not spark joy. It does to the eyes of Papa Nurgle. 
Mary Poppinigle is all of his children, even those that he turns. Oh, that's what I've been forgetting the entire game as well. What's that? Uh, every every turn of Skimming has died, I can bring, I can heal my units. In death there is life. This is the first time I'm hearing about it. <laughs> you definitely have forgotten about it. I have forgotten about it completely every single game that I've played. In his defense, he plays 40k a lot. That's exactly it. I play, I play 40k a lot more than I play Age of Sigmar. <laughs> However, these guys are on square bases, so we don't ask questions. No. Uh, second time. Oh, didn't I tell you about the square bases? Pardon? Didn't I tell you about the square bases? Square bases are good. Square bases can't score objectives. Oh man! Oh, well, you lost the game. <laughs> 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 Alright, we'll let you do it this time. Uh, this evening here, we'll try to charge into your general. Oh. We're going to try to, to slay me some familiar generals here. Disappointed. Uh, it looks like it'll do it. That's a 5 and 6 or 7. 5 and 2 is a 7, I think it's 7. Definitely in. 7 will definitely get me in. You yeah. probably get to both for the 7. I don't, also, I don't want both. Oh, he does your one. I see how it is. I just, I just want the one. Alrighty. And that will take us to the combat. It sure will. Yeah, sure I'm will. less confident than I was last time. <laughs> fair call. <laughs> Very fair call. Where would you like to start, Jeff? Well, um, how choppy choppy is your general? Uh, he's pretty choppy choppy against monsters and heroes, but again, normal dudes. Not so choppy choppy? He's less chop. Okay, so the, the female warriors are more choppy choppy than the general is. They definitely can cause more wounds in a turn than he can. <laughs> okay, so we're going to swing against the, uh, the female warriors first. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. One of the beasts, yeah? Pardon? One of the beasts? Oh, the, the, the beasts not yet, because I'm going to charge afterwards. Oh, you're going to you're gonna go with the plague bearers then? Yeah, so the plague bearers, because I have more plague bearers and... Damn it! So we'll be swinging with 26 attacks. Oh, good. So... Turns out like less to hit for me if there's that many models, yeah? Like minus one to hit or something? No, no. Oh, for you to hit me, yes. Yeah. Yeah. 26 attacks from the plague bearers here. And they'll be hitting you... If I can grab them all eventually. Hitting you on fours. Is this plus one to hit this turn? Plus one to wound. Plus one to wound. Hitting on fours. Uh, so these are normally wound on threes, but plus one is two. It sure is. Oh. You can count, Jeff. Math is good. Stay <laughs> in school. Uh, so anything but a lot of those ones. Yeah. Equals... Four, eight, nine wounds. Nine is too many wounds. Let's let's chop that down to no wounds. Oh, uh, we should try. Four plus. Uh, four plus. One, two, three. Five wounds, and one of them would already lost a wound. So that gives us two dead Famia, which is no fun. Okay. Um, unfortunate. I think I'm gonna to have to retaliate with the boss. With the boss, boss okay. man. Okay, so he is five attacks. Okay. Um, threes and threes again, minus two rend. So, let's see how many plague bearers the boss man can take out. Two misses. Three misses. Not, not terrible. Not too shabby. Terrible. Not too shabby. And two wounds. Um, Three wounds. Uh, he does not get any extras for his. Because uh, he got a magic item versus heroes, but not versus dudes. So that's just three two. wounds minus two rend. I'm looking for a five plus uh, disgusting resilience, and we make one of them. Oh, so two down. Let's see if his uh, tail does anything. It does not. It does not. Oh well. Mm. That was my big shining general. Uh, I will then pile in with the dog. And swing with the dog. Okay. Dog's so, still hurry. Dog's swinging away. So he's got uh, d6 wings. For six. six attacks. Three, four, five, six. Hitting on fours. Oh, we missed with these three. And we're winning on twos this time. Okay. So we're winning you twice. It's four, four ups again. That's not going to do it. One. Uh -huh. Takes four. Oh, well, I'll just move this one up. <laughs> and then he's going to give you a lick. Give you a lick. 
His leg hits you. Uh oh. His leg wounds you. And his leg is not saved. And his leg is red too. So, another one down. Mm. Look out. Only two for me, three for me left. Three remain. Ouch. And the next dog will give you a, a, a good old kiss. So, we'll start with his leg. The dogs are separate, aren't they? Yeah. So, you swung with your units. No, no, I swung with my general. Oh, my apologies. You swung with my familiar. My apologies. Sort of write them his off yet. automatically missing next time if, he, okay. if he's alive. If he's alive. If he's um, alive. Well, I'm definitely going to swing at the plague bearers. So yes, he, he lives! De <laughs> he's definitely going to be alive. Okay. Plague bearers. Let's see if... Oh, that's, oh, that's a lot of hits. That's not bad. From here, that's not bad. Um, let's get some sitters. Sitters. Oh, no. That's, that's made up for it. More than enough. One, two, three with the mortal wound. Four. Four. Alrighty. And a whole bunch of misses. Okay. Four wounds. Four or five pluses. Make oh, uh, three of them. Man. Only one. Only one. Ouch, that's not the comeback that I needed, gentlemen. I know. I'm gonna choose my dog now. Oh, surprise. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Who's kiss missed? Okay. His kiss did miss. His kiss did miss. So now he's gonna do his D6 attacks. Yeah. Four, four. Okay, we can do that. We can do this. Yes, yeah, so he's sitting on fours. He's, he's, he's not, he's not. not loving you at all. That's not what's gonna happen right now. Not today, not today. And then up over at Plague Bearer Land. Oh no. So we're going to do the piles now. Try to get a few more dudes in there. Eight, nine. Okay. So I'll be hitting you on fours. And we will be wounding on twos. Not a big fan of these twos. Only five. Three, four, five. Okay. Five. Four ups. Two saves, three wounds. And he has seven wounds. He's down to four. Down to four. Uh oh. Um, no more attacks after that? No more attacks after that. Okay. Right, there we go. Alright. Okay. End of combat? End of combat. Wait, within three, we are. We're inside of three. Oh, there we go. Let's see if we could do D three wounds on a four up. We can. D three, two mortal wounds on your plague bearers, and you're only gonna take one. Take one away. Well, it was worth it. It was worth the one. I'll take it. All right, combat. There is a bravery test over here. Mm -hmm. That is for sure. Down three from leadership seven. Oh, oh, six, seven, eight. Seven, eight, nine. That's two more. Two more, wait, the last. Two more, flee. Uh oh. We're running out of Famir on this side of the board. Mm -hmm. Any other tests? No, your leadership's just too high. No good. Okay, that's turn three over. That is turn three over. You gotta get your points. I do gotta get my points. Three. So we're claiming three there. And one over four. on this side. And none for the middle. So that is another four to your seven. So it's eleven against three? Eleven against uh that's for two to you? No no I didn't get it. I oh, saw it in my turn. Uh so I get four, it takes me to eleven, that's correct. Eleven against three. Uh, three playing eleven. Wow. Let's see who goes next. Alright. It's gonna be vitally important. Looks like it's Andy again! Oh no, it's a tie, but I break ties, so it's Andy again! <laughs> Let's see if I can drag myself out of this mess. We'll be right back. Okay, this is going poorly. Um, unless there's some sort of miracle that I haven't even calculated, it's game over for the Famir, but we like to bash stuff anyway. So yeah. we're going to keep bashing stuff. Bash with gold. So we are going to, in the hero phase... We're going to use our Mist Weaver person to cast her Cascading Fire again, which is her any unit in three inches in combat. Um, she's got it. I have them too far to stop range. Um, the hero is going to not do anything hero based for now. Basilisk mm -hmm. is back out of range for its hero power, mm. which it just seems to be for this whole game. <laughs> <laughs> Range is a big issue for these Vermeer, apparently. So we'll go on to movement. And 
I want to kill both of these guys. Fortunately, Treadmoors travel a very long way. They do. Unfortunately, familiar warriors do not. Mm. So they are going to have to run to try and get over there and do. Wow, six inches. Anything useful. Yes. Okay, let's get up close. Do See, Jeff may have moved just enough of these plague bearers out of the way that if I kill enough, I might have more models within six. Ah, right? Ah. Which would definitely save him getting another three points anytime soon. But you do get that in your turn. So I get him right here, yes. It may all be for naught. Well, how many how many models does the big old bassy count as? Only one. It's only the heroes and leaders that count as turn models. Look, 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 I know, right? It makes no sense. This big chap counts as one. Yeah, it's sad. What do you do? Like, but that big chap's gonna spit you in the face now. With your plague bears, he's gonna nice. get his five. He's not gonna get his five, it's fine. He tried. Um, the, it's the five that counts. The Mr. Weaver slash Fire Valley is gonna use her uh, fire attack on you. Yes. Which is four plus D3 wounds. Uh, any unit within six inches. So she's gonna be the closest unit. She gets it. D3 mortal wounds. Three mortal wounds, sir. Mortal wounds. One, Let's two, not three. be too disgusting about it. No saves. No saves. Three, Three dead. Down. No mass. Mm, no mass. Three downed. Uh. Can, I, can I just add them to this unit? <laughs> <laughs> Shush. Um, the Dreadmoor is going to spit at um, that guy with the sword. Now, can I use my look at server roll? Yeah. The... <laughs> you don't have a unit. <laughs> you only got another character. But he, he counts as a unit, does he not count as a unit? I think you have to have more models though, isn't it like a unit of three or more models? <laughs> Possibly. I'm gonna say no to that one. Oh man! <laughs> look out so with your other general, shut up. Um, so he's gonna use his attack force to hit. Hit, spit yeah. in the face. Three to wound. He gets it. It is minus two rend. Minus What's two. stick guys save? So four plus. Uh oh, so he so gets a six. He gets a six. He gets a six, don't do it. Don't please, do it, don't please. do it. No. D6 mortal wounds. D6 mortal wounds. I'm on a high one. No, not what we wanted. Two, five plus. No, oh, he three. takes two, he's down to three. The Dreadmore really wants to get rid of both. So it was on Swordman. Yep. Um, shooting, shooting, shooting over. It's as impressive as my shooting phase gets. Let's charge some stuff. Here's a thought. Here's a thought. Maybe I could charge into combat this turn. Double ones? No double ones. No double ones? Let's double ones. Start with the Dreadmoor this time. One and two. Come on. Two and one. Yes. That'll do it. That'll be right between the two. I really want to kill both. Um, I guess. I mean, I guess you can do it. <laughs> Basilisk. Come on, Basilisk. You've got to be close enough this time. Seven. Is it yeah, that should seven be right. close? Seven is close enough. Seven is close enough. Eh. Metal, Shuffleboard. Metal models. <laughs> and we've got our fire breather here. Let's see if we can clear out enough guys. Oh no. No, she will not make Five is not enough, but it's enough to go this way. It is. And that's the beautiful thing about Age of Sigma. Charge first, decide who you're charging second. <laughs> okay, so still may not be good enough to get that objective. But we'll see. I might start with the Dreadmoor, Jeff. Are you sure you want to do that? This is where it all falls apart or all comes together and I was right the whole time. <laughs> um, I will start by attacking your... The guy that's not wounded. The general dude with the belts. The banner. The scribble pox. He's gonna get his... Threes... No, force the kids. Rerolling ones. Is... Yes. No, 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 that's the spray. Sorry. I had that right the first time. Three's to hit, two's to win. And reroll your sixes, please. To hit? Yes. Oh, is it that time again? It's that time again. Um, no sixes, but all hits. No sixes, but all hits, okay. And two's to wound. Mm hmm. Two's 
two wounds, two and it's wounds. minus... Rend minus three, sir. Goes through my armor saves. 2d6. 2d6. This is the roll that we need. Dramatic roll. Six wounds. Eleven Eleven, alright. Well, I've got, uh, I, I got a five plus against this. So I'm going to roll three to begin with. That's what I got in my hands. All right, uh, no, he's taking, he's taking three. Three saves, that's three saves, three wins. Uh, three, all right, and we're gonna try that again. Oh, Four he's down wins. to one. Five, mm, six wins, that's a dead uh. general. Oh my god. Uh, uh, uh. Can the Dreadmoor save us? <laughs> and get us some points on the board. He has his 3d6 attacks left against the other guy. Big numbers, not big enough. Seven, eight, nine only. O only he says. Nine attacks. Nine attacks versus the guy with two wounds left. But we are fours and fours now. Oh wow! Only two. Please reroll that six. Oh, you wouldn't. I wouldn't. You wouldn't. Reroll the six. Come on. No, nope, there's no way to kill him. Yeah, there we go. And he counts as ten models. So. There we go. I mean, he gets the win though. He gets the win. Gets any, the win. Any, any negatives on this fella? Is minus one. So he's sitting on a five now. Mm -hmm. Doesn't get, Doesn't get it. Yeah, Disgusting though. Super five? No. Right. Oh, he takes up to his final wound. <sighs> so close. <sighs> so close. So close. Um, that'll be your turn to choose. Your turn to choose. Okay, so we're going to come over here. Okay, so we're going to firstly pile into that. Oh, oh. actually. Uh oh. Start of the combat phase. Oh. The basilisk, any unit within three on a two up suffers a mortal wound. Okay. Around a basilisk. Take a mortal wound or a disgusting resilient save. No, I'll take a mortal wound. Okay. One down. One down. Just yeah. 30 more rounds to go. <laughs> okay. So, we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's not enough wounds. That's not enough wounds. That's ten attacks. Yeah, that's right. Oh, look out! I'm gonna look at here. All right, so it's a perfect roll. We need perfect rolls. I'm gonna be rolling seven because that's what I have. Mm-hmm. Hitting out. Let's move these ones out the way so we're not confused. Well, you could roll them. Shush. Shush. <laughs> so I'm hitting on Two, three. threes. Four. Sorry, hitting on fours. So three that's hits. three. So I rolled seven. So I rolled three more. Three more dice. Oh. There we go. So while we won't be killing him with just the plague bearers, mm -hmm. we'll be winning him on twos. Okay. Three. Three. Any rend? It's a plague bearer, so no. No rend. No rend today. Five ups. No saves though. Down to seven. Down to seven. And that's probably going to bracket him. Okay. Um, they've attacked, so yeah. my general might go next. See how many he can take down with him. Rolling. Oh, do I have to re-roll those sixes? No, you do not. No, 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 it's just a good feeling. Yes. Big sixes again. No. Uh, one six, which will go through your armor. So four wounds, four disgusting resilience. Four disgusting resilience. Alrighty. Next one. one three through. And he will also have his tail, which will hit on a four, and will not. Will okay. Not. All right. My choice, you say. My choice, you say. So, I'm not overly concerned by a back guy. Oh, you should be. So I'm going to come over here and punch your your fire, your, your mist breather in the face. Oh, look out. So we're going to pile into the mist breather. Okay. So I've got six attacks against your mist breather. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna use one of your dice here. So I'm hitting you on fours. Yep. And these guys are my little cheerleaders who died. Mm -hmm. Hitting on fours. Ooh. Oh, two. It's two misses. And winning her on twos. Yep. Equates to three wounds. So I'll take five ups, some saves. Two saves. Ooh, doing oh, doing better than I am rolling fives. Um, down to six wounds. Down to six. Oh, fire belly. Okay. And then and you're up. Strike back with its two attacks. Watch out. Rolls to hit. Ooh, two hits. 
And threes. Two wins. Two wins. Minus one wins. Six plus saved. Makes one. The other one is D3. Uh, one. Can't. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> Five up. Six. Damn it. Okay, make all your saves there. That's fine. Uh, well, I, I will. The other half. The other half. Oh, wait. I attacked you back before you got... You to the channel. That was my bad. <laughs> That's okay. I did similar over there with the Yeah, ball. that was a continuity error. <laughs> but I didn't kill anything. You didn't kill anything. So it's okay. We're just going to pile some more some more plague barriers into here. Since we're not going to be getting them anywhere near that objective. Uh, we're going to fight him with 14 plus 1. Mm. So I'll roll 5 or 3 times. Yeah. Alright. Hitting on for us. That no, one, two, three. Mm-hmm. And a down tree. So three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Uh oh. Uh oh. So I'll roll five and four additional. So we're on two still. So that's going to be one, two, three. Four, five, six. Six wounds. And these have no rends and only damage one. Four ups. Hey, you're not too shabby. Three of them. He had five left, I think. He had five. So it's down to two. Down oh. to two wounds. Oh. And, technically, I fought back with my mage already. So it's your turn again. Yay! So, we're going to punish this Fimir guy right here for thinking he was brave. Not Dave. Not Dave. Sorry, Dave. 14 swings versus Dave. Yup. 14, so I'll do 2 lots of 7. Okay. Heading on 4, so I got 1, 2, 3, three. 4. Oh, yeah. 6, 7, 8. 8 total. So we'll just grab a, another dice there. And winning on 2 still. Dang. 7 wins, Steve. 7 sir. wins. Come on, Dave. You got this, Dave. You got this. Super, super Dave. He don't got this. He doesn't got this. Dave's dead. Dave is dead. Good night, Dave. Dead, dead. Off to join your other buddies, Dave. <laughs> no. Your turn? Oh no, you get to fight back. Oh, oh fight yes, back. that's right. I get to fight back with my sword man. Guy is alive on one wound and ruining my chances of winning the game. <laughs> uh, it's okay, he only has three attacks. Uh-huh. Three attacks hitting on threes. Okay. Two hits. Okay. And he's winning on twos. Okay. Two wounds. And he is a negative one rend. So that's four ups. Oh, no. no, one goes through. One goes through. That is worth one damage. One damage? Mm. One taken. Okay. Is that the first damage he's taken all game? Yeah, he's down to 13 wins. Down to 13 wins? That's it. Lucky 13. Lucky 13. Keeps coming up. Now, if I remember right, the Skaven back in the day loved 13. Love 13. Big 13 fan, Skaven. Very big 13. They love the 13. That's, well, let's count up my points for that turn. Okay. So, over on Andy's side of the table there, where he's got that one well and truly covered. So, so two. Takes me up to five. And over there I do not, and over here I do not. Oh. Because your leader counts as ten. Oh. And you've got many more plague bearers than I have basilisks. Uh, she's close too. Is she close? But I have more bearers than you have her and him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Between the two of them. Not enough. Not enough today. That's uh, 5 to 11, five and to Jeff 11. has another turn. Alrighty. It's looking bad. We'll be back. Back. <clears throat> and all right, Jeff. How are you going to finish me off? Alrighty. Well, I don't know if I can, but I I've generated my points. Take me to 20. 20. Uh, as, I mentioned, as, as, I, as I messaged, uh, as I mentioned to Andy, I'm one off from bringing in 20 more plague bearers. <sighs> such, such, a, such a pain. Um, but because I've got the Taliban of Nurgle going on as well, I'm going to heal my units now. Oh god. So, I can't recall if any died here, but I think some of that no, was, it was only that one dude, yeah. 
It needs to be 30 dudes. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to bring back D3 to this unit here. The two. So I have one died, I believe. So I'll return one plague bear. Thanks, Jeff. You're welcome. Uh, now this fella here, he only regens a single wound. Back to two. Oh, yeah, so down by three. Over at this unit here, these lads here will regen three plague bearers. One, two, three. And they will come to fight the lovely Lady of the Mist. You might have to put one in the middle okay. to join the unit. It gets very nasty if you don't join units. Fair enough. They, they, they are now joined. <laughs> Uh, and then we will regen D3 over here fighting this basilisk. Three. And no, awesome. Regenerating more than a died. <laughs> Twenty. <laughs> <laughs> so don't think That's I all I managed to kill. I don't think I can actually regen more than a starting number. Yeah. I don't think I remembered to attack with that thing. Doesn't do much damage anyway. Uh. No. Doesn't matter. Uh. I'll, uh, I'll wear that one, because the attack characteristics of a Basilisk aren't great anyway. Mm. Sorry about that, Andy. That's alright, Jeff. Don't, worry, don't mind Jeff, he's Canadian, so that's why he's saying sorry. <laughs> that's why he's saying sorry when I made a mistake. It's, it's, it's what we do. We, 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 we're genuinely sometimes sorry when we're not meant to be sorry. Science story on that one, though. Did you? Heard, yeah. Is that um, when Canadians say story, it, sorry, it is not an admittance of guilt. I heard that story, yeah. like, today. Yeah. I was like, that can't be real. Is that a real thing? It's a real thing. Right. So, if somebody were to die, I'd say, I was around, and they assumed me as a murderer, I would say, sorry. In but, general, they'd be like, well, you killed them. Yeah. But I'm Canadian. I didn't. Wow. Prove me wrong. I wonder if that, that <laughs> law goes international with you, or it's just like, no. Sorry. I think it's Canadian. Yeah. In Canada alone. Like. It only counts in Canada. <laughs> Uh, otherwise, my Canadian heritage, I'm part Canadian Indian, I would pay no tax, and I'll show you if that carried over. Oh, yeah, that's which true. Which would be great. Yeah. Because I don't pay tax in Canada, it's brilliant. Why are you here? My wife's Australian. Uh, plus, Canada's cold. Minus 50, it's not bad. <laughs> Minus 50. <laughs> no, thank you. It's fine, don't worry about it. Um, so, I'm going to start with movement. Yeah. And move my dice out of the way here. Uh, so, my plague bearers have a. Oh, sorry, I'm going to cast spells first. So on a seven, I'm going to change my tree table again. Oh yes, I changed the tree. Do it again. I'm still too far away. I'm too far away. So again, I am getting plus into my wounds. Plus one to your wound rolls. My wound rolls. So these lads will move four inches from here to here. Uh oh. And they'll also advance. One. Ha ha. One. All righty. And so that was a total of five inches. Yeah, I believe it, you. It, it could have been like it could have been you know, Greg and Clemens all over the board. <sighs> Makes me shudder. Yeah, as, as, as it should. Oops. There we go. Oh, and there's another one here. All right, there we go. And then we shall move our beasts. Now they move five, and they will advance while they're at it. For this one here, mm -hmm. he will advance a walking two, so he's gonna go seven inches. He's gonna come play with some from here, hopefully. Straight into the pendulum. Straight into the pendulum. Does he does he get hurt if he walks through the pendulum? Well, it's anything the pendulum passes over or stays within an inch of when it finishes moving. So I don't know if you walk over the pendulum, does that count as it passing over you? Because it, it happens at the beginning of the turn phase. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't think you're allowed to walk through it though. Message us. <laughs> when you see this video in two weeks' time, tell us that we got it wrong. Oh, we'll, we'll D6 it for the time being. Yeah. Uh, and this one will move and run as well. A whopping six. Wow, he really he, wants to touch a pendulum. Lift. Lift. <laughs> Lift. pendulums. Uh, in we go to the pendulum. Come here, pendulum. Okay. Oh, well. In good old Nurgle fashion, I've got zero shooting. Yes. I'm going to go to the charge phase of the game. It's one of the other things I love favorite one. So it's my favorite phase. Okay. Uh, we're going to try charging these uh, pestilent boys into the dread maw there. Double ones! Double fives! Four, five, six, seven. I yeah, don't seven. think seven will do it. It's got to be within half an inch. Within half an inch. Oh, it might not be. It might not be. Uh, I don't think you will get in. We'll call it that a fail. 
See, if this beastie guy rolls high enough, he can just go around the pendulum anyway. Anyway, so, so these lads are out of that combat. We're gonna go to this beastie boy here first. He's going to go ten inches. Wow, he can definitely go around. He's fine. <laughs> he cares. He cares not. And this beastie boy. He's going to go five. five. He won't make it at all. No. Okay. Oh, that changes my game plan a little bit. Question is, where do you start now? Where do I start now? Well, uh, he's as good as dead. <laughs> That's my plan. That's your plan, so we're not going to bother with that fella. We're actually going to start over here. Ah, okay. So we're going to start opening up into the Lady of the Mists. Okay. Alrighty. And I'm not going to retaliate until you're finished this time. That's my plan. <laughs> so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Eight? Going within an inch. Eight. Eight. Uh, the, the 25 mil bases, so <laughs> technically they're within an inch. <laughs> uh, eight swings. Eight swings. Head him on fours. Uh, that, that, this. It's just that winning on twos nonsense again. It's that winning on twos nonsense again. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There's only two wounds there. Two wounds, and she has got five up. How many did she lose already? She lost uh, two. And she's going to lose another one, so she's down to uh, four wounds left. Down to four remaining. Well, down to four. Dice to remember. There we go. Right. And versus yeah. this, this fella here, we've got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve for the jet. Twelve for the jet. And four, eight. Twelve. So hang on for us. Yeah. <coughs> and twos. Five wounds on the uh He only had two left, I believe. Mm, two left. Four ups. Four ups on the Come board. board. No! Just, just enough! Just. He's down, the general. Slain. Slain where he stands. Ouch. Okay. That's not going to help my cause at all. Uh. Um. Oh, of the, I suppose the Basilisk will do its uh, mortal wound. One mortal wound. Take one. one. You're close enough. Takes it. Yeah. And um, I shall. He's got seven wounds. Mm. I think he might survive. But the Familiar will definitely survive. So let's actually attack with the Basilisk this turn, shall we? <laughs> let's actually kill some stuff. So. Alrighty. Uh, venomous Bites. Three, one attack. Three up and three up. Yep. Three up and three up. And it makes it, and it is. Rend. Minus two. Okay. So looking for a five plus. I think it's resilient. No. And that is three damage. Ooh. Also, that's two more discussing the resilience. Ah, uh, two down. Two down. And the other one is his clutching, clutching claws. That's going to be hard to say. Clutching claws. Clutching claws. Or a clutching chicken. Right. Yes. Fours and fours. Fours Only one. Only one. And the clutching, clutching claws are minus one rent. So six plus. That's no good. That's no good. Damage value? One. One. Five plus. No, another one bites the dust. Down. That is that brilliant five back from the vessels. <laughs> Alrighty. And then I will fight the familiar over here. Okay, no. Dog. So you see attacks. Dog will lick you first. Lick first. Lick. Wound. Okay. All right. Save. Does not get. One damage. One damage. So, actually, it's a new turn. So he's back on three. So he'll go down to two again. Okay. And then D6 more. Three more. Three more hitting on fours. Two are getting. And two wounds. Two wounds. Two wounds. Two, wounds. two more saves. Come on, four ups. Let's save yeah, them both. Nice. They are good. Alrighty. Um, so the only one left for you to attack with is that hero dude. And those guys. 
and those guys. So I might go for the hero dude, hey? Dreadmore! Solid choice. Solid choice. Uh, let's finish this guy off. Threes and twos. Rerolling ones. Threes. Two go through at minus three rend. Damage D6 apiece. Damage D6 apiece. Nine wounds. What the flesh wound? He's got two left. What a flesh wound. Let's see how he goes. Now, let's see here. Do I survive this? Why didn't that just beat all? No. Yeah, they so dead. No. Very, very he, made, he, made, he made a few, he made a few, but he's <laughs> down for the count. Ouch. Well, I finally got that objective now that I can't score it, and you're about to take it back with a million <laughs> million errors. But, you get to fight still. I do, I do. So we are going to... Oh, I do, over here. Over here. So it's time for some consolidation inwards. 12, 13, got the baker's dozen. Mm. Plus one. Ouch. Two, three, four, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen, and plus one. Heading on fours. Damn it. It's not a lot of fours. It's a whole lot of ones. It's a whole lot of not ones and twos. Look at all the ones and twos. And twos. So that's going to be. Big ol' four wins, are ya? Fours, and we got fives to save. Oh, oh, two makes two. So, down to five wounds. On the basilisk. On the basilisk. Now he's bracketed. Now he's bracketed. Okay. Yeah, sure. Sure, he's bracketed on five. Okay. Um, I will go... Back to the Femir. Oh, oh the, the chick. Care of the fire breather. Mist two attacks. Bre Mist, 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 Mist Weaver. Mist Weaver. Two hits, and she's got threes to wound. She's gonna get one of them. Uh, minus one rend. Oh! D3 damage. Only one. Only one. No! Oh. No, one down. Which gives me my Femi, I believe. Yes. So. Let's uh, file some of these in. Drag them forward at least. And we'll take a swing two inches. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, we're gonna change up some of the colours of our dice this time. Trees and trees. Whoop. Okay. My dice like you better than me. Yeah, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good roll. Should have done that ages ago. But our powers combined. <laughs> um, what's his uh, save like? Uh, his save is uh, 5 plus 5 plus. Okay, so he's not going to get his regular saves anyway, so I'll okay. just turn two extras into there, and that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 wounds. Flash wounds. Uh... Last time I said that's something bad. <laughs> yes. <laughs> sure did. Let's do that again. Alrighty. Saves in here. I believe he's only got five wounds. Oh, that'll do then. No club no. tails for you. No, 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 no more. Off for you me. go. There we go. And that is the end of that combat. That's the end of that combat turn there, sir. Uh, are you going to roll ones and get all these guys to come back or oh, what? That's right. <laughs> uh, so, shock over here. No, nope. Nope. Fine, no. but they're fine. Shock. No, but, but they're fine. also fine. And that's it, I believe. That's it. Alrighty. That's the end of turn four. I'm going to score three you more score? points. Yes, three more points. One, two, three. And none for that side. So it's 14 against five. So. 14 v five. This is the point, I think, Jeff, where the familiar bow out gracefully. At the end of turn four. Let's yeah. have a look. Let's have a think. If I get okay. the Famir over to there mm -hmm. and manage to stay the horde, manage to stay the horde. See, if I you have were to get, get within six, uh, if you were to get these guys here, charge them and draw me in, takes me off. That gives you three, four, five. If I scored all of these objectives, one, two, three, four, five, six. 
that would still not be enough. And if I scored all the objectives another turn, I would just make it to. Just make it. <laughs> so I think I think we're done as far as actually being able to all win right. this game. But good nurgling, Jeff. Good game. Well done. All right, the Famir. We didn't make a complete joke of it in their first ever game. Let's hope we do better next time, though. Any final thoughts, Jeff? Um, the chicken. Yeah. I like his mortal wounds. You like his mortal wounds? I like his mortal wounds. He does, he does mortal wound now and then. See, this was part of my genius plan. See if, see what you think of my genius plan, Jeff? Yes, yes. In order to win these, these games, these tournament objective games, I have to keep my Famir warriors that do lots of damage right next to my Basilisk and right next to my Mr. Weaver, who also does mortal wounds. Who's mortal wounds? As you can see, the plan worked perfectly. My I Mist Weaver that. and Basilisk spent no time at all this game near any Famir warriors <laughs> at all. <laughs> the Famirs just took off over this side, left them behind, and that was not the point that of the game. The no, it was not. <laughs> and I paid for it. <laughs> Big time. But, MVP, once again, the, the Dreadmore. Dreadmore. He loves it. He loves chomping through stuff. Not sure about this pendulum, though. Didn't do much. Didn't do much. They're uh, cool. They're cool. Yeah. And uh, your MVP is all the plague bearers, always. <laughs> all the plague bearers. Oh my god. Things that don't is go away. Nightmarish. Okay. Well, thanks for watching us play a game. Thank you for coming out, and uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed watching us play. Yeah. We'll see you next time. See you later. Bye.